Parker, what are you doing? So we have a patient here with an uh, anterior nosebleed. Um, she's had a couple in the past before. Um, she came in with bleeding in her right nair. Um, she did a tampon at home. Uh -huh. She put a tampon in her right nair and it stopped the bleeding. Then it started coming out the left nair. Um, so she put another tampon on, tampon on that side, which also stopped the bleeding. Um, but yeah, it actually was a very effective idea. So we'll just, we just capture that. So. She actually... The right nair is tampon got completely saturated and they had to take it out and the EMS had to put another a four by four in there. Four by four in it, yeah. Bleeding. Okay, so what are you gonna what are we gonna do today? So today we're going to um, her her bleeding's effectively stopped now, but with her having the recurrent bleeds, um, we have a high suspicion that if she goes home it's just gonna happen bleed, again. Bleed right. again, yeah. So we're going to plug her back up with a mirror seal. Okay. Um, we had this. Um, we're also going to Prior to doing that, we're going to use a little aphrin nasal spray oxymetazoline to right. constrict the blood vessels in the nose. Um, as well, we're going to cover the mirror cells in uh, TXA, um, tranexamic okay. acid, All right. um, to help for the clotting. So, and, and, and that's a, and that's a relatively new recommendation, but right. it, but it seems to be the the small studies that are out there seem to suggest that it works in uh, helping uh, prevent recurrences as well as stopping the bleeding. So. Right. Blow your nose for us. Get all any kind of clot or anything that's in there out. Come to the other side too, real quick. Very good. So, how are you going to put this in? Which so the Marisol? Yeah. Um, it's going to expand as it. Just like one of those child children's bath toys that uh, expand when you get them wet. Spent. Yeah. So as far as lubrication, we're going to use a little bit of antibiotic ointment okay. um, on the tip because um, this is a dry thing. And then we're also going to coat it in the TXA. Soak it up with the TXA then. Yeah. All right. Put the lubrication on first. Okay. All right. And these things just go straight back. The temptation a lot of times is people put these in the nose is to think you got to go up, but now you got to go okay. straight back. All right, a little discomfort, okay? I'm sorry, sweetie. You're doing great, though. Okay, good, good. Okay. And now we're going to wet that down. I'm going to take this from you one second, okay? All right, and this is the TXA. You doing okay? Uh-huh. Very good. Okay, so that's saturated with TXA now. If you want to add a little afrin in there too, just to... For good measure? Yeah, for good measure, just make sure that... A little afrin. That's good. All right. And that, that came together really, really nicely, so nice job there. How you doing? Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> It's not like it's not choking you or anything like that, and it feels comfortable. Well, it's kind of got my head hurting over here. Okay, but as far as but but as far as the discomfort in the nose, it's not too bad. Uh, All right. No. Okay. You can sometimes get sinus infections because once you have these in, and and we'll we'll talk about whether or not we just want to just prophylactically put you on antibiotics uh, to prevent you from getting a sinus infection. And obviously, if, if, if this worsens and comes, has to come, if you have to come back, then you just come back here and we'll be glad to see you again. All right? Good enough. All right, so you were, you were giving me some advice on, on the video here, so. Yeah. We had just finished a session of a no bleed session. Dr. Mr. Larry Melick. Melick had just finished a no bleed session with the young doctor in training, Parker Smith. Mr. Parker Smith. Yeah. And now, if y'all need to know anything about no bleed checking, no, no, no bleed you will now know. Session. Now y'all know to go check Dr. Melick out on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Do you guys know him? <laughs> no, I don't know. <laughs> you got a great family. <laughs> All right, thank you.